Hi guys, I'm Elizabeth South and I am here today because I wanted to let you know that I'm one of the very first people to get an Apple Watch and I thought that I would give my own personal review and what I think about it. Um, so far I'm really loving it. So um, I'm going to take the camera and zoom in on the actual watch and just show you some features and just some thoughts that I have about it. Okay, so here is my Apple Watch and if you notice like when I put it down it's dark and then when you lift it up to look at it it automatically turns on also um, you can just tap on it and it does the same thing if it's off and so I have the um, sports band um, with this um, stainless steel um, watch itself okay so to customize the um, watch face you just hold it like this and then you can scroll over for whatever look you want you can do um, Mickey or any of those things and you can customize it, do your own thing. And so I have mine like this because um, I like all these features here. Um, you know, the weather and the, the activity. So to customize it, you hold it down, click customize. If you over here, you can change the color. That's pretty cool. I like this color. Switch over here and this, you know, you just tap on which part you want to change. So you can go like this if you wanted to have um, this feature, like the, the date or um, large or, you know, they have all kinds of different little things, stopwatch and stocks and stuff. Um, so I'm going to put it right now on this one because it's pretty cool. All right. And then you just tap um, here or here. And then what I like is, you know, if you want to go check your weather, you just click on that and it goes you know to the weather app which take a second right now it's a little slow the internet and then you can click on the the rings here and that'll take you to your activity um bank you know circles and this is where i have my criticism of the watch because the outer ring which is the red one um counts calories and as you can see i i am you know, it's going to show you how many you've burned, but I'm a step person. I like to try to get 10,000 steps every day. And so I told them and kind of wrote them and said, I'd really like you to, to fix this. I don't know if they will, but I'd like it if they have the option for steps. So then that ring, when you go to your face, see the outer ring would show, and then I can be checking really quickly. I can just look and see where I am for my 10,000 steps. I'm going to go back, but it is really good because I had to try to figure out how many calories would be 10,000 steps. So at four, I think it's more than that. Um, exercise, you help, you know, it lets you know, a reminder to stand. But it does show your steps. If you scroll up like this, here it is. As you can see, I haven't done a lot of steps yet today. <laughs> um, calories and all that. So, you know, it's great. I like it other than that. Um, then you can scroll up like this and it'll take your heart rate and... Um, and then, you know, you can put different modes of the thing and um, music and um, calendar and temperature. You know, it's really neat. And then you click again here and it shows your different apps. So you've got your apps. Um, you can do like a stopwatch. Oops, I hit the wrong one. That was the phone. Um, exercise. Let me see. Twitter. Hmm. Okay. And then that one. Yeah. So you could do a stopwatch or just some really neat features. Um, another thing, like you click this little thing and it has like people like this is, um, my mom and she's here right now with me holding the camera actually. And so I'm going to call her and just show you what making a phone call is like. You'll call her phone. Yep. There we go. And I'm going to hang up cause she's not going to answer it cause she's helping me here. You can click on this thing in the middle and you can do like a um, message to her. Like, so it tells you if you want to do a sketch, heartbeat or a tap. So if you want to do a sketch to send that person a sketch, you can draw and go, hi, something like that. Or you can do some really crazy stuff. Okay. Um, and then um, I really like also um, this feature, you know, the heartbeat. So you have to do two fingers. You hold it. Oops. Hold on a second. Hold it. Oh, why is it doing that? See, I still don't know it very well. Ah, there we go. You can tap them or poke them. <laughs> Pretty neat features. 
So I am loving it, I think. And I think that the the other criticism I have is that if I wanted to go like on a run somewhere, like go out like on a trail, which I usually do treadmill, but if I wanted to do that, you do have to have the iPhone within range. Like it doesn't have to be on you, but it has to be close. So you couldn't make a phone call or, or send a text on a run without your phone somewhere close by. If this phone ever got to the point where I mean, if this watch ever got to the point where you could go running, go take, just leave the phone at home, it would be like the perfect, <laughs> perfect item. Although it's pretty awesome, but I'm sure that it will be doing up. They'll be having updates and they'll be improving it all along. So I'll wait for those things. But so far I have a pretty positive review for it. Hope you enjoyed watching my video.